Boys will be boys. Our own Sean Guillen got an inside look at one of their favorite things, cartoons. This is my little guy, Drago. This is the guy that I voice. So in the show, he comes out of this kind of ball form and becomes this giant dragon. And uh, yeah, it's a lot of fun. I was invited to the voicing session for the new animated series, Bakugan, and caught up with Jason DeLine, who voices the character Drago. So what exactly is Bakugan? Well, it's an animated series about a group of kids who find these cards that fall from the sky, and they use it to play a game. And they have these marbles that they roll who turn into monsters and battle it out. And if you win, you get to take the other person's Bakugan. If you lose, you lose yours. You think you're pretty good, huh? Well, you better buckle up, Shuji, because you're going down. Bakugan battle! What sets Bakugan apart from other shows like Pokemon, Yu-Gi-Oh, these big, huge things that kids love? Well, I think that the, it's really rooted in these great characters, and the kids can watch the show, and they can get uh, strategies from the show on how to play the game better, and it kind of goes back and forth. And when they're playing, there's a real sense of role-playing, more so than regular role-playing games, because they can associate it with characters that they see every week who feel very real to them. It's happening again! My body's burning up! Wait, that's it. Maybe I'm beginning to evolve. We just saw you voicing some of Drago's lines. Does your voice hurt after you're doing that whole growl, angry, roar thing? A little bit, um, but it's, it's worth it. I mean, this is a blast to do. Uh, yeah, sometimes you got to put on, you know, a lot of gravel, so that's a little bit unnatural, but you get used to it. You have some coffee and have a nap in the afternoon, as is our lifestyle sometimes in this business, so... <laughs> It's not too bad. What's it like for you watching the show with your own voice coming out of the big dragon and the whole thing? <laughs> I don't get I don't get used to it. I get really excited. Like I get up and I and I watch it on Sunday morning and I'm like, look, that's me. And my friends are like, yeah, it is you. Like at first they're like, no, it isn't. But yeah, it's it's pretty exciting. I, it's fun. I've always wanted to do something like this. I've always wanted to do a cartoon or animated series of some kind. And uh, yeah, it's a dream come true. And it's a really fun show to be to be doing that on. So I'm pretty happy. Nah.